Hello everyone, Rich here, back for part 4 of this MS Batori tutorial. Uh, today's focus is the ship's top superstructure, uh, possibly forecastle cranes, masts, and all the other things like that. So uh, that's for today. Uh, to, before, before we start though, I'm just going to go down to the sides of the ship and on the inside walls that we built in previous videos, uh, I have now added the doors and windows. So doors and windows on these inside areas here, uh, and also on the deck below further back as well and also we've got a shadow glitch going on which is always wonderful so there's doors and windows down there as well so that's all fine um, and also down on the back end as well but I did that in the previous video anyway so uh, there we go anyway that's all the doors and windows sorted I've also added the doors and windows to the top superstructure as well which I forgot to mention so doors and windows up there uh, so what we're going to do first we're going to sort out the ship's wheelhouse so before we do that we've got to add the wall around the bridge wings so we go from the center of the front of the bridge wings and we're going to build a wall around the bridge wing up to where the bridge wing reattaches to the superstructure at the back. So just build a wall around the edge of the bridge wings, like so, and then back in again to where they reattach to the superstructure there. There we go, so that's one side. Let's do the other side quick. All the way around, like so, and then to the back. Like that and there we go there's both bridge wings done so what we we'll do now go back to the center and we're going to add the ship's wheelhouse so on the center of the front of the bridge wings or the, the, the wheelhouse whatever uh, we're going to add a pillar on the center like that two blocks high and then either side of that we want to add three windows both uh, three windows each two blocks high so first window there leave a gap add a second window leave a gap third window so there's three windows there and then three the other side so three there three there three there so six windows <laughs> three other side so that's there we go that's your uh, windows added and then add pillars in between so pillar pillar and then a pillar at the side there like that and then the same the other side pillar pillar and a pillar there there we go so there's the front of our wheelhouse and then for the sides uh, we're going to go from the back end of that side pillar and we're going to build a line 22 blocks long down the side so we go 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 so there we are and then you build one block in like so and then start again we need a line of uh, 6 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 and then one in again and then we want uh, 16 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 like that and there we go that's that and at the end you should build in four I think or is it three four three it's three so build in three one two three plus the center block there we go so that's the back wall so do the same on the other side so it's 22 so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifty sixty seven eight eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two one in and then six one two three four five six one in and then sixteen I build it freehand and then build it across so there's the 16 and build it across the back like so and there we go that's all joined together like so, like that basically and that is the uh, ship's wheelhouse and funnel number one support which we'll go on later on and then what you want to do is build all these walls four blocks high all the way around so uh, I'll just do that quick as I can so I use weld edit to build them up so four blocks high all the way around and it's what we want so I think it's four blocks high uh, We'll go with it. And there we go. That's one side down. As you can see, the walls are, in, are increased in height there on one side. So I'll just quickly do the other side. Um, I'll just uh, work out what I'm doing. So go from there down to the front end and copy it across. So it's just stand here, and we do copy, flip to the right, and then we paste. And there we go, there's both sides done, and that's all the walls increased. And you do the same across the top of the front of the wheelhouse, so I add a line along the top of the ship's windows on the front, like so. Join them all together like that, and there you go, there's the ship's wheelhouse, pretty much done. And then for the roof, it's basically uh, just wood blocks, basically, so just add a wood roof like so and it shouldn't look too bad so just add the deck on the top I shall stand on this block here and use the fill tool to fill in the rest so we do fill wood by 300 
and that's filled in the roof and uh, there we go there's the ship's wheelhouse now for the windows on the side there's only going to be a few because there's not a lot of detailing on the sides of this uh, wheelhouse so for the sides this is on the right side uh, we'll add a window to the side there and then a pair of doors like so and then I'll add a couple of slabs to the top of the doors to add a bit more ventilation and then leave a leave a block gap and add another window leave a three block gap add another window and then another three block gap add another window and I think that's really all we need because there's not a lot of detail like I was saying so window doors window 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 so I do the same the other side may as well so put our window there and then our pair of doors in there plus the skylights and then window window and a window there we go so there's our three windows there and there we go that is our ship's wheelhouse done for the moment but uh, there will be more detail to go on in a bit so uh, we'll worry about that in a bit um, one more job concerning the uh, bridge wings or two more jobs really but with the first job for the bridge wings we're going to add a set of stairs so we're on, on the back of the bridge wings where they attach to the superstructure back here we're going to add a pair a set of stairs so remove four white blocks like so and then uh, we'll get our wood stairs and we'll build our stairs going down to the deck below like so, so it's staircase two blocks wide and then we'll add our supports underneath and then the banisters going two up two up two up like that and that actually worked out quite well where I placed the door. The door's only placed at random, but uh, it actually fit in the right place. So uh, there we go. So that's that uh, set of stairs there. I do the same on the other side. So remove these four white blocks. And then replace with our stairs going down like so. And there we go. Plus the supports underneath. And then the banisters, two up, two up, two up like that. And there we go. There's our stairs added there and then the last job for the bridge wings we're going to get our quartz slab and we're going to add slabs on the underside of the bridge wings all the way around so just add the, the, the slabs going around it just makes the, the bridge wing look a bit thicker so I just add the stairs going all the way around up to back up to the uh, superstructure like so it just makes it look a bit thicker that's all and we do the same the other side behind the stairs like so and there we go there's our bridge wings pretty much complete marvellous right um, so I think now uh, I think we could do another job which concerns the deck below the uh, bridge wings so underneath the bridge wings we got uh, the deck here and what we're going to do is directly below the back of the bridge wing on the side of the ship so we've got the back of the bridge wing here and then directly below that on this on the deck below we're going to add a wall now this wall you can just see it I just added the first block there directly below the bridge wing on the side there. I'm going to add a wall all the way around the front to the other side to the back end of the bridge wing there. So I'll add this wall around the front like so. All the way across the front. And then up to the back end of the other bridge wing on the side like so. And there we go. That's that one attached there. And there we go. There's the wall done there. Marvellous, brilliant, beautiful, right, that's that job done. Uh, so I'm going to leave that now. What we're going to do, I'm going to do a jump cut. No, I'm not. I'm going to take a look at my notes first. Because uh, we need to do the next deck house. So avoid the, the uh, jump cut. We're going to go to the back end of the deck house we just built. Excuse me while I just scratch my head. <sighs> um, what we're going to do, go to the back end of the, the deck house here. And we're going to leave a gap. And we're going to count back on the wood count back 23 blocks so first block there and then count back 23 so that's 5 10 15 20 and then 23 so on the 23rd block we put a red block to mark the center and then we're going to build this wall here nine wide so that is uh, four either side so one two three four there one two three four there so it's nine wide like that and then the sides are 23 this right so yeah 23 wide uh, 23 for the side so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 and then do the same the other side <laughs> 23 long there 
so sorry, a bit tired. Like so, and then across the back, mark the centre as well. That's basically just a rectangle we want. So uh, there we go. And then what we want to do is increase that all to four blocks high. So two, um, two, three, four, all the way around. So that's what we want. Four blocks high, all the way around. So there's no real, uh, no real uh, hardship with this one. And then down the other side. And then across the back. And there we go. There's our deck house sort of laid out there. And then for the roof, uh, if I look at the prototype, the roof, I think, is actually quartz block. So I use white to fill in the uh, roof um, for this one. So I just do the first few like so. And then I shall stand on this block here and just use the fill tool to fill in the rest. So just want a, a white roof basically. So fill uh, quartz by 30, 100, whatever. And there we go. So just remove that block I was standing on. And there we go. There's the deck house done. There's no real detail to go on window wise. But uh, there will be a bit of a detail to go on the side anyway. So for the side detail we're going to go to the back side or back of the, uh, the deck house itself. And this is on the left but it's the same on the right so you don't need to worry. So on the left side, we're going to go from the back and count three forward on the side. And then we're going to build a pillar, which is four blocks thickness, like so. And then it's going to be three high, like so. So there's one there like that. And then we leave a three block gap again. So one, two, three. And then on the fourth block, we'll do the same again. Like that. So you've got two thick pillars, like so. And then do the same the other side, basically. So third forward, build a big square. Like that, and then four blocks forward, do the same again. And there we go, that's those two thick pillar thing what's it's there. And uh, that's that. So um that's our little job done. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna do a jump cut while I work out what to do next. And uh, then we can move on. So uh, back in a moment. Okay, back again. So what we're gonna do now is work on the front details, uh the forecastle and the deck just above the forecastle. So we'll focus on the uh this deck here just in front of the superstructure and uh, we're going to add some cargo hatches first so we're going to go to the front wall of the uh, upper deck and go down to the, uh, basically where we are where are we uh, so yeah we're working on this deck here so we're going to go to the back wall or the front wall rather of the upper deck and from there we're going to count forward uh, to the uh, third block forward so one two three then we're going to build our cargo hatches uh, seven wide, so that's the centre block plus one, two, three out, one, two, three the other way, and then the sides are five, so one, two, three, four, five. Same the other side, one, two, three, four, five, and across the front like so. And then the centre three blocks on the top we build across the full length of the hatch, like so. And then either side we just add slabs to put the rest of the cover on, like so. So you've got a, a hatch cover looking something like that. There we go, there's our hatch done there. And then the second hatch, what we do, we leave a, a two block gap again, so three blocks forward. We do exactly the same again, so it's seven wide, plus one, two, three, four, five for the sides. So it's exactly the same design. And you just want two of these, basically. And then the sides as well, so add those bits in. There we go, there's our two hatches, they look something like that. And then what we want to do now is go to the front wall of the uh, the deck we're on, so go to the very front end, and then go two blocks to the side, so you go front, there's the centre block, so we'll leave that, and go two out to the side, and what we're going to do is build a line of three on the wall there, and do the same on the other side, so a row of three there like that, so you get your two rows of three sort of <laughs> looking like that. And what we're going to do is build a row of three behind it, and another row of three on the other side. So I'll focus on one for the minute. So build the row of three on the wall and then a row of three behind it. And then build another row of three on the top like that. Like so. And then build another row of three just below it like that. So you've got a sort of design looking like that. So it's a row of three, row of three, row of three, row of three. Four rows of three like that. Looking something like that. And then you build those rows of three down by rows of three. Like so. And then one block below you build another well, say I'm not one block below, but uh, one block back, you build the same again. 
build the rows of three like that. So it's it's sort of a, a weird design, but it's just rows of three. So it's basically looking at it from the side, you want a, a flat row of three plus on the top like so. And then two rows going down to deck level like so. It's not very easy to explain, but that's uh, sort of what it looks like. And then what we'll do, we'll get our court stairs. I'll we'll put stairs to build to make curves on this thing. So on the section there, section there like that. So you've got your curved bits there. And then the same on the front or on the back wall like that. So the section closer to the hatch looks like that. So you've got stairs there and then stairs there. It's, I think it's a ventilation thing, but I don't know, but you know, it's it's on there anyway. So that's how that sort of looks. And it's three wide. And of course there's two of these, so I need to build the other one. So I just do this as quick as I can. And then we add our stairs. And as I said, they're not, not very easy to explain, but they probably explain more just by looking at it. So there you go, there's the other one. So yeah, there we go, there's those two, whatever they are in the, in, in place. <laughs> and they look something like that. Not brilliant, not perfect, not beautiful, but they are there and that's all I'm going to say. So that's those two things there and uh, at least you can see the lines around them so you can sort of get an idea on how it's meant to look um, so what we're going to do now is go back to the back uh, cargo hatch, the cargo hatch closest to the superstructure here and then go in the gap between and between the, the wall and the, and the cargo hatch we're going to go two block or one block forward sorry so there's the first block, go second block forward and then we're going to count out to the side which is uh, nine out to the side, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And on that ninth block, we're going to build our crane. And the crane I build, uh, I usually build them in yellow terracotta. So I get that yellow terracotta or yellow concrete, whatever you want to do. So it's it's one forward and nine out to the side for our ha uh, for our crane. And the crane body itself is fifteen high. So that's one already. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen plus one back on the top like that and then we build our base around like that so it's basically a star around the bottom and then for the arm itself go third block up so one two three and then we want eight rows of two forward so it's one row of two and then that's two three four five six seven eight so it's eight rows of two forward like that so that's our crane there and then do the same the other side so what was it it was one forward and then nine out on it. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Build our crane there and the base. And it was uh, 15 high, wasn't it? So two, uh, three, four, five, six, seven, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Plus one back. And then the arm was eight rows of two forwards. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight like that and there we go there's our two cranes in place there and if you want to you can use rigging or well, yeah, iron bars or something for for rigging to attach to but you know it's up to you how you want to uh, go about making those things um, I tend to avoid doing that but you know, it's a simple thing to do um, and then for the second set of cranes um, we're going to go to the front of the superstructure now front of the first uh, f the cargo hatch closest to the front so this cargo hatch here and we're going to add the second set of cranes and these are two blocks forward of the hatch, so one, two forward. And then we want to go outwards. Uh, let's try to work this one out. We want to go out six, so out to the side six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And we build our base again. And this crane itself is. Uh, how tall are these ones? These are 16 high, I think. I think the best thing to do is build them the same. So build them 15 high, so two, three, four, five, six. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Like so, and then build a star around the top. That's slightly different to the other ones. And then for the crane arm, the crane arm goes backwards as well as forward. So it's 8 rows of 2 forward and 8 rows of 2 back. So third block up, we build our 8 rows of 2. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Well, that's 8 there like that. And then same back again. So 1, 2, 3, four five six seven eight like that and there we go there's our third crane there and then do the same the other side so it was um what was it eight six out to the side when it says so one there and then we go out one two three four five six and do the same again 
So was it was 15 high, so 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, plus the star around the top, like that. And then the arm itself, third block up, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and the same at the back as well. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and there we go. There's our four cranes on the bow like so and it should look something like that now what we're going to do is add the mast so we'll add the mast on the center between those two weird sculptures on the front there so roughly about the fourth third block forward of the cargo hatch the cargo hatch is there and go one two three blocks forward and then we'll add our um, our mast there and the mast itself is basically three rows of 15 going up so so that's 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. There we go. So there's our mast in place. Fourth down from the top. So 1, 2, 3, 4, build out 3. 1, 2, 3. And then 4 down from there. So 2, 3, 4. Make it five, build out four, so one, two, three, four, four out, and then one, two, three, four there, and there you go, there's the spurs at the top. And then roughly uh, a third up from the bottom of the second 15, so the bottom bottom 15 is there, the second 15 is here, and go about a third of the way up, the t up, up that row, and we'll add our crow's nest, so I want to add a crow's nest basically like that, so f five blocks around like that. And then add the stairs on the bottom of it, like so, like that. And then just add a wall around the edge, like so. And there's basically a crow's nest. It kind of looks like a bathtub, but you know. So that's the uh, crow's nest there, and it don't look too bad. So that is pretty much all of that deck done there. And um, what we can do now is add the handrails around the edge of it. So we'll get our iron bars. And we'll add our handrails around the edge of this front deck. Like so. And then do the same the other side. And across the front as well, of course, between the two sculpture things. There we go. There's our hatch, um, hatch, but our <laughs> handrails added there. Right, so that's that. And one more job to do on the side, where the um, the white wall here goes out to the side, and where it attaches to the black on the side here. Just in front of that, on this point here, we're going to add. Um, I'm trying to think, I got it written down here. Anybody bear with me? So we want uh, two rows of four upwards. So on the black here, build up four. One, two, three, four. And then in front of that four again. One, two, three, four. And then in front of that three, no two, sorry, one two, and in front of that one, like that. So it creates a sort of curve of the superstructure. So it's four four two one. I'll do the same the other side. So we want four one two three four four again one two three four two one two, and one like that. And there we go. That's those bits added. So that's that little job done. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to do another jump cut. Want to work out what to do? and uh, we shall move on so back in a moment okay back again so what we're going to do now is work on the forecastle which is this front deck here on the uh, curvy part of the ship uh, so what we're going to go, go and do now is go to the front wall of the uh, superstructure here we're going to go from there and we're going to add a cargo hatch and we're going to count seven forward of this uh, between these two uh, gargoyle things so count on the wood seven forward so one two three four five six seven we should add our first cargo hatch there. So this is seven wide. So it's the same design as the ones up there. So it's seven wide. So one, two, three that way. One, two, three that way. And the sides are five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And then across the front, like so. And then the center blocks, like so. And then the slabs, either side, like that. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 there we are. So well, there's our hatch there. And then what we want to do from there is go uh, add one block, or count one block forward, or 
or second block forward onto this block here. It should be on the groove of the uh, of where the, the deck goes up by one block, and from there, we're going to build a line of so a single line of blocks, seven wide. So that's a single block centre, and then three either side. Like so, this is sort of uh, a deck house, but not a deck house, if you know what I mean. So build it three, uh, seven wide like that, and then build in front of that a same thing, but two high, two blocks high. So seven wide, and then two blocks high like that. So it's it's sort of an L shape from the side. So that's what you want, like that, and then add stairs in the groove like that and that's basically all it is. I don't know what it is, it's probably a, a, a ventilation or something like that or it could be the sort of the foundations of what could have been a breakwater but who knows and who cares but there we go so that is that thing done there and then in front of that uh, on each side so one block out from the centre of that front wall we're going to add two uh, design, hang on, done that wrong how do we do this? We want to add a block in the centre plus two, uh, two, two blocks forward like that in black and then like that so basically yeah that's what you want, you want a big E basically so on the front of that deck house build a big E like that and then we're going we're gonna to add um, uh, anchor chains now the anchor chains I use are formed with uh, cobblestone, is it cobblestone? no brick stone, stone brick stairs rather so we're to use those and then we want to build these 14 long so uh, we're going to need seven going one way and seven going the other way. So, the way I designed this, I build one, two, three, three, four, five, six, seven like that, and then on the inside build the same thing, facing the other way. So that should be fourteen long in total. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and build it thirteen long. That do so thirteen long, like that and it don't look too bad. So like I was saying the chains are formed of these brick stairs and they are facing opposite directions to each other to make them look like chain links if you know what I mean. So build it 13 long rather than 14 and uh, it should sort of look look something like, like I said, it sort of looks like chain links from certain angles but uh, you've sort of got to use your imagination with it but that's all we have really. If, if this was from the depths then we have chain links coming out of our assholes but uh, don't have chain links in Minecraft but there we go. Um, and then at the end of the chains you just add another big E like so and there you go two big E's with chains in between and there you go that's your, that's your anchor chains and uh, they don't look too bad so after that um, we want to add uh, a mast so we go back to the, the to the front big E and we're going to count forward uh, six forward so one two three four five six and on the seventh block we add our mast, which is eight blocks high. So in white, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And there we go. There's our forward mast there. And that is pretty much it for uh, main details, if you know what I mean. And then what we want to do now is to add uh, our handrails. So we're just going to get our handrails, which are iron bars. And what we're going to do, we're going to go back to the uh, where the white ends on the forecastle, so the white part ends there and from the end of the white you're going to add handrails along the side of the ship going towards the white section on the back of the uh, forecastle. so I just add the handrails like so and if you're familiar with my builds I usually complain about this but uh, we got where the handrails go over the corner blocks of the wood we need to remove the wood blocks underneath and replace with black so that the handrails sit on the edge of the deck uh, on the edge of the uh, on the edge of the ship so it just looks a bit better in my opinion and it's, it's nothing that you have to do but uh, it's just uh, a cosmetic thing. But uh, there's the handrails down that side there. Oh, hang on, not done that that block there. There we go. I'll just to quickly do the other side. The handrails on the other side. Add our handrails. I'll, I'll replace the blocks first, and then do the handrails. There we go. And then the handrails like so. And there we go. There's our handrails there. And then the last job for the deck itself is to add the bollards. The bollards I use, or well, I, I use uh, anvils for the bollards. So I use anvils. And we're going to need two pairs of these. So roughly next to the uh, anchor chains, or the, the big E on the front, we'll add a pair of bollards there, like so. And then we'll add another pair of bollards just in front of where the, uh, the handrails begin. So put another pair of anvils there. They're, like I said, they're not in any specific place they're just sort of uh, randomly placed but uh, a pair there and a pair over there I'll do the same the other side so a pair by the handrails there 
and then another pair up next to the big E at the front like so and there you go there's your handrail um, the iron bars added there marvellous brilliant and that's that for the folks all mainly but uh, one more job really is to add w doors or windows to the front walls or to the side walls really of the uh, front superstructure so the folks all there and then you've got this curved wall here you're just going to want to add your doors and windows to that so I just get a couple of doors and the windows and what we do I put a pair of doors in anywhere these, these are not in any specific place these are just placed at random again so I put a pair of doors roughly there and then we put oh bloody hell I put single windows in and around the ship because the deck goes up slightly we need to put the window one block higher so there we go window there and then windows down the side like so and there we go just a little random design there and uh, it don't look too bad so that's that side I'm going to quickly copy that to the other side because otherwise I'll uh, probably screw it up putting it in the right place so I'll just quickly copy that so there we do our copy flip to, flip to the right or left whichever way and then we paste and there we go there's our doors and windows on the other side brilliant and uh, it don't look too bad so that's the folks all done and uh, it don't look too bad um, and then we can do the next deck up so get up to the next deck where we added the cargo hatches and cranes on the front wall of that we can add windows to this front wall now so we're going to add from the edge or go from the center actually and go, <coughs> go sort of second block out we add a pair of window and actually go third block out so start again actually so start from the center and go three blocks out so one two three and we'll add a pair of windows there same the other side so one two three out a pair of windows like so so nothing on the center there and then next wall along we'll add a pair of windows like so and then the next next wall along we'll add a central window and a window there like that so basically it's four windows on the front wall two on the second wall one on the set next wall and one on the third fourth wall so uh, my bloody cranes keep getting in the way right now do the same on the other side so I put a window and a window and then a single window and a single window there we go that's that bit done there marvellous so that's that job done and then next we go to the next deck above which is just below the ship's wheelhouse and we shall add single windows to that so go from the centre again and go second block out so two blocks out add two single windows like so so single windows like that and then a single window on the middle again and then that's pretty much it so single window on the next wall and that's that for uh, that deck there <laughs> marvellous so that's that job done there and uh, it don't look too bad so the next job we want to do now is go on the top of the ship's wheelhouse and uh, what we're going to do is go to the third block back of that and we're going to add a small what well, looks like a sculpture but it's sort of a mast thing so on the center of the uh, ship's wheelhouse at the top go three blocks back so one two three on the wood and then we build a plinth which is uh, sort of like that and then we build uh, I'm trying to think when we did this so it's two blocks on the side like that and then one block forward hang on now, how did I do this I can't remember let me just, let me just find out <laughs> so how do we do this we wanted there's a plinth of three by three and then up two up two up two and up two okay 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 I'll try that again okay all right so we've got our, our plinth like that so at the back we want to go up four one two three four like that and then we go on the front up two side up two side up two like that there we go that's what we want so it's a uh, three by three at the bottom two up two up two up front middle and sides and then Two up on the top at the back. There we go. That's what we want. That's what we wanted. <laughs> I knew I'd screw that up. Anyway, next is to add a sort of platform thing, which I don't really know what it's for, but uh, it's there anyway. So we we'll go three blocks back from the front of the, or, or from the back of the uh, the thing we just built. But we'll go three blocks back from that, or four blocks rather, and then we build a sort of platform. We build three wide, and then build that three high like so, and then we build the sides one, two, three, one, two, three like that, and that's pretty much it and it's supposed to be a platform so I suppose you can put wood blocks on the inside plus some wood stairs as well for um, 
the purposes of unknown but there you go there's that thing there but so that's the sort of basic design but you can make it a bit better if you want to so remove the two sides there and then go sort of like that and then make it slightly wider so remove these four blocks here and then make it slightly wider like that it may look a bit better but uh, it's up to you what you want to do and then we put a block uh, make it slightly wider for the floor as well and there you go you've got a sort of platform thing going there not brilliant not perfect but uh, as the law says it will do and then what we'll do then is go two blocks back from that and we're going to add a vent so the vent is like I say, two blocks back from the stairs and we'll add a vent which is a cross like that on the center so a cross like that and this one goes I'm just looking at it from here I think it's about three high so build up one two th I'll build it to three blocks high like so and then up two in the middle like that and then with our court stairs we're going to add facing back towards the stairs. We have stairs, stairs and stairs there. Stairs on the top. And then for the other side we go two blocks forward, two blocks forward, two blocks forward and one forward. And then stairs underneath, on top, around the other side and underneath like that. And there we go, there's our vent added there. Marvellous, brilliant, beautiful. And uh, the ship is definitely taking shape. So that's that job done there. So I'm going to leave that as it is for now. And I'm going to do another jump cut now while I work out what to do next. And uh, then we can move on. So uh, back in a moment. Okay, back again. So now we're at the back of the ship. And we're going to sort out the details from there. Uh, before any we build anything on the top, we're going to go down to the open area on the back end of the ship down here. Um, in this, this, open air, this open promenade here. We're going to add some pillars. So we're going to go from the centre on the uh, back end here. We're going to add a central pillar there basically in black, so we're going to build it up basically to the height of the uh, the deck itself because it's not attached to anything, so build that three high there and then every fourth block round to the side we're going to add a pillar, so one, two, three, four, add a pillar 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 one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. and there we go, there's our pillars all added there and I do the same the other side. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, <gasps> one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four. And there we go. There's our pillars all added there. There will be more pillars to go on later as well in the uh, upper promenades, but uh, I'll worry about that later on. What we're going to do now is go to the top end of the stern and what we're going to do is add four bollards so we're going to go roughly three blocks forward on the end of the wood and we're going to add four bollards which are anvils again so I get hold of those so we're going to add four pillars uh, facing sort of like that I think so four bollards like that if you know what I mean so they're not, <laughs> they're not really in any specific place just four bollards looking a bit dizzy like that um, and that's that really uh, and then what we're going to do now is add a couple of benches and these are if we go back to the, the end of the wood here we're going to count forward to the seventh block forward so one two three four five six seven and then out to the side by two so out one two there and the same the other side one two there and put a central block for each bench so there's two blocks there. the center is there so you want to go two out to the side and then these benches are uh, how, how long are these? These are six long, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, like that. So that's one already, two, three, four, five, six. And then with court stairs, add the bench detailing around, like so. Quite large benches, it probably don't need to be that wide, but I'm just following what looks like, like how it looks on models and things like that. But uh, there we go, so there's those two thingy me what sits there. And then the last job for this deck is to add the handrails. So we'll get our handrails again. And just go from the end of the white. Add the handrails on the top of the black blocks. Like so. And there we go. That is the handrails done there, and that's that deck pretty much sorted. There may be more detail to go on later on. I uh, can't see any from here, so I'll leave it at that. So that's that. Now we're going to go to the next deck up. 
So the next deck above, we're going to go to the end of the deck here, and we're going to add a large white box, which is uh, seven wide. So on the edge of the deck here, but it's seven wide. So that's the center block, center block, plus one, two, three either side, like that, and then build that to three high. Like so, so it looks like that, and then the sides are uh, four. So one, two, three, four forward. And build that to three high as well. So it's basically a large, probably a deck house, but I'm not really sure its purpose, so I'm not going to comment on that. <laughs> but there we go, there's the large box there, and then just fill it all in with the roof. <laughs> like so, and there we are, there's that uh, thing that we want to sit there, and uh, it don't look too bad. Now, what we're going to do now is add uh, four vents. I'm just trying to work out how this goes actually. So go to the front of the box and then go to the sides and then go, I think, go from the side and go about two blocks out to the side and then sort of two blocks forward. So from the edge of the box, two out and then two forward. And then we're going to add a vent which is three blocks high and one block forward. Now make it four blocks high and one block forward, makes it look a bit bigger. So four blocks up, one forward. And then three blocks around the base, like so. So it looks something like that. I do the same the other side. So what was it? It was out, out two, forward two, wasn't it? Yep. And then build it four high, plus the blocks around the, around the back, around the base, like that. <laughs> there we go. And it don't look too bad. And then from the front of that ha uh, front front of the vent, you want to count forward seventeen, I think. No, hang on. Uh, Yes, yeah, 17 forward, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. And do the same again. So it looks something like that. I'll do the same the other side, but I won't bother counting. i just compare it to the other side. And there we go, there's our four vents on there like that. No real detail around that, and I think that's pretty much it, really. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So the last details for this deck are, of course, the handrails. So go back to the end of the white wall on the overhang. We just add handrails around this edge, like so. Same the other side. And there we go. There's our handrails added there. So that's that deck done there. And then the next job is to go to the next deck above and do more detailing there. So I'm going to go to the back wall of that deck. And there'll be no handrails added to this one yet because we've got to get the lifeboats in. But the lifeboats will be put in in the next video. Uh, for this one we want uh, one block forward from the end on the wood. We're going to add seven rows of two. So we've got a row of two there and this is for the mechanicals, you know, the things that attaches the pulleys and things. So I put a, uh, a, a row of two there and then every uh, other block put three rows of two out to the side. So we want seven in total. So it's centre one plus three that way and then three the other side like that. So it's three, uh, seven rows of two like that. And then on the top, join them together by a single line of blocks, like so. And there you go. That's that thingy. Me, what's it done there? And then what we're going to do is go back to the back end of the deck and on the wood. We're going to count from the first block of wood forward to the mast, and the mast will go 11 blocks forward. So that's the first block, and count to the 11th. So that's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and 11. On the 11th block. We build our mast, which of course is in yellow terracotta, which I'll keep putting away. So I want 11 blocks forward and that, the mast goes there. So the mast is three rows of 15 again. So it's 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 1, 2, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And there's your mast. Four down from the top, or five or four, whatever, build out three. 
and then five or six down from there build out four one two three four one two three four and there we go there's our master done there marvelous and then that's that so what we want to do now is to go back to the mast and go forward of that for the cargo hatch the cargo hatch goes next and that is um, four blocks forward so fifth block forward sorry so uh, one two three four five we build our hatch there and this is a bigger hatch this is a uh, nine wide so that's the center block plus four either side so that's going to be nine wide, and then the sides are seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then build them across the front like that. And then the center three, as before, build across the length of the hatch, like so. And then either side, you're going to want your corpse stairs. Same the other side. And there we go, there's our hatch done there. And then uh, we're gonna add two vents and we're gonna go to the front court front left and right corners of the of the cargo hatch itself. So the front corners of the hatch, we're gonna count from that block, uh, from this block here, we're gonna count out uh, how far do we want? I'm going to go out 9, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And then we build our vent there. So there's our first vent. And we do the same on the other side, so it's 9, nine out to the side. Let's double check that. So it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So the centre of the vent is the ninth block. So same on the other side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Like that. And there we are. There's where our two vents go. And the same with the vent on the uh, the front of the ship, on the top of the wheelhouse. We build this one facing forward, but it's four high. So, two, three, four, two, three, four, two, three, four, two, three, four, plus two in the middle, up two. And we're going to court stairs again, which I keep putting away. Stairs, 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 stairs. And on the front, two forward, two forward, two, two forward, and one. And then stairs, 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 stairs. Stairs, 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 stairs. And there we go, there's our vent there. Same with the other side. Up four, two, three, four, two, three, four, two, three, four, two, three, four. Plus two in the middle. And then vent, uh, stairs, 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 stairs. Two forward, two forward, two forward, one forward. And then stairs, 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 stairs. Stairs, 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 stairs. Like that. And there we go, there's our two vents added to the back end of what is the boat deck. Um, let me just work out my notes, bear with me. Right, so what we're going to do now is go back to the back end of this deck and we're going to add the cranes. So the cranes go from the back here, we're going to count forward. Uh, forward seven, so on the wood count forward seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I'll put a yellow block to mark the centre there. And then we want to go count out 10 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 out and there's where our mast will go for the crane so the crane body there same the other side 10 out so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 and there's where our other crane goes there so remove that block there so the crane bodies themselves are 16 high so that's 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 plus the blocks around the top like that, and the blocks around the bottom, like so. And then third up from the bottom, we need to build the crane arm. So the crane arm itself is just eight rows of two backwards and forwards. So one row, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, like that, and the same forward. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, like that. There we go, and then do the same on the other side. So that's 16 high. Uh, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Plus the blocks around the top and the blocks around the bottom, like that. And there we go. And then the third block up, we do the arm again. So 8 rows of 2, that's 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And in the back, 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And there we go. There's our two cranes added there. And they don't look too bad, do it? And then we're going to add a couple of mechs to the front of the uh, cargo crane. So I add, uh, go roughly two blocks forward of the crane itself and add three dashes of the black blocks like that and then join them together, join them together across like that. And the same with the other one. And then across the back like so. And there we are, there's that detailing done. And uh, I think that is enough for today on that deck there. So that's fine. <laughs> And it don't look too bad. So what we can do now is go to the open deck, the middle open deck. So we've done the first open deck down there with the black pillars. So what we'll do now is we'll go to the middle one. And what we're going to do there is to add our pillars. And these pillars are going to be end rods. So we're going to get these detailings out of the way. So we want end rods. And sort of every fourth block basically. So if we go four blocks from the end of the white here. So one, two, three, four and add our first pillar there. And you can see where we're going with this one. So there's our first pillar, and then every fourth block underneath the overhang here. So that's one pillar there. So that's, that's two pillars. So every fourth block, so that's pillar there. One, two, three, four. Pillar there. One, two, three, four. Pillar. 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 And then under the bridge wings, or docking bridge rather. One, two, three, four. There. Four. And then one, two, three, four, there, and that would be the last pillar there. So how many is that? That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's ten pillars on that side there. So that's ten pillars under that section there. And then the next deck above, uh, the last two pillars of the deck above, we can put them in the same position as the pillars below. So look where the pillars at the below are, and then put them in the same position as the ones below, like that. So you got those two pillars directly above the ones below and that's fine and then the same process as again every fourth block forward until you get to the end so I should do that now so every fourth block so one two three four 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 and one two three four one two three four one, two, three, four. Uh, four. Four. There. Pillar. Pillar. Very mundane job, but the results pay off at the end. It does look better. And that would do, I think. We've got all four, all those pillars in place. And uh, it don't look too bad. It looks right, actually, doesn't it? Uh, it makes it stand out a bit more. The only downside with these end rods is they do create light. So, uh, you know, it does make it look a bit odd during the day. But during night time, it don't look too bad. But, yeah, they do produce a bit of light. But that is all the detailing I'm going to do for today. Because um, we've got uh, quite a bit done anyway. So, uh that's it for part four basically. I'll, I'll do the other side as well. I've, I've only done this side of the pillars so I'll do the other side off camera but uh, it, will, uh, it will look fine when it's all done but like I say I'll, I'll do the other side later on. But uh, that's it for part four. Um, part five we've got uh, just finishing off to do which is the funnels, lifeboats, a few deck details, uh, the white stripe which is something that needs to be done and some side windows I think. Uh, maybe a couple of staircases but uh, overall not a huge amount to do so there's another fairly small ship build we get this all done in five parts which uh, is all the more rewarding and uh, it don't look too bad so that's it for part four like I was saying so for part five was all the crap I just mentioned and so we'll leave it at that so this is Rich signing off locking off disappearing and I shall return in part five so uh, bye for now